Here we're asked to find the equation of the line passing through negative 3, 4 and 6, negative 2. Now any line can be written in slope-intercept form y equals mx plus b. So all we have to do is find m and then find b. Remember m is the slope and b is the y value, the y-intercept. Now to find the slope, we're going to use the slope formula. The difference of the y values divided by the difference in the x values. In this case, x1 is negative 3, y1 is 4. x2 is 6, and y2 is negative 2. Substituting in these values, we have y2 minus y1, or negative 2 minus 4. Divided by the difference in the x values, 6 minus negative 3. Simplifying in the, here in the numerator, we have negative 2 minus 4 is negative 6, divided by 6 minus minus negative 3, or 6 plus 3. We have negative 6 ninths, which, re, which reduces to negative 2 thirds. And we found the slope. We can go ahead and substitute that in. We have now negative 2 thirds x plus b. Now all that's left to do is find b. We can do that by substituting in any one of the given ordered pair solutions and then solve for b. In this case, I'm going to use the point negative 3, comma 4. Now remember, x is negative 3 when y is 4. So when we substitute in, we're going to have a 4 here for y and a negative 3 for x. The only variable left is b. Here 3 cancels, leaving us with negative 1. And we're left with 4 equals negative 2 times negative 1 is 2 plus b. Subtracting 2 on both sides, 2 then equals b. And once we found b, we can put together the equation of the line. So here we have negative 2 thirds x plus 2. This is the equation of the line passing through the two given points.